Hi, hello. I have here a rose knot and I'm going to show you again because the rose knot is a difficult knot, so difficult that we have to come to it in several materials. This material it's a yatch rope. It's very slippery, very plastic like and uh, synthetic. And um it has these holes. Why? Because it is so slippery and so hard that we cannot pull it never. So this is not appropriate for this kind of knotting, but it shows very well where we have to insert exactly the ropes. So I've chosen this one and it is so big that we have to see it. So I'm going to undo it for us to see. So this is a rose knot, a classical rose knot. It is described in navy books several navy books now in here what we have should have four so it's this one this one this one and this one take a good look you see it here you see this design in order to be good we have to have this design this one has to come here this here this here and this here if the if there is a, a another design it is because it is wrong when we pull it, it will be curled over itself, curled, and it makes these round turns that gives the beautiful rose, like this. The rose is always like this. It's a very interesting design. So, I'm going to undo it. Then I'm going to do it briefly. Because why? Because I'm going to show how to do an easy knot that it is not a rose knot, but that makes an illusion of a rose knot, okay? So this is so slippery that I... Come on, where are you? <laughs> All right, so here we have it. You see the design, this is the design. We have always to be with this design. If we don't have this design, it's not okay. So I'm going to take it out. You see, it passes under himself, exactly here. All they pass under themselves. You see it? So it passes there, under himself. All. All has to pass. Okay, I'm going to... Aha, uh -huh, this one is not in position. I'm unturning it. So here it, here it comes. Aha, uh -huh. uh -huh, it's okay. It is already so slippery that not even me I can understand it already. But it was all right. But it it uh, because it is so slippery, it it um, step away from its proper places. Let's try to do it. We're going to do it fast because we have already worked rose knot on other videos. So, under, under, this is the basis for the rose. It's a Matty Walker knot. So, under with all, all working hands. All working rope hands. So we should have a, a design like this. If it is like this, it's perfect. Now we pass it under again, the next one. So this one under the next loop. It is immediately ahead. Nothing. So this one under this one. Now the last one, the same. This one under the loop that it is presented. And here we have the Matthew Walker knot. Now, as I, I tell you, don't do these knots with this yatch rope, because this is slippery and the knot does not stand with its form and its functions. These knots, actually old knots, they were made it for twisted rope and twisted natural fibers rope made in these modern ropes they are even dangerous okay 
So this knot actually is so good that if you give it space, you can walk. Take a good look. You walk with the knot and you put the knot wherever you want. So as you can see, we have walk away from the tape and put it here. And with this slippery rope, this is very easy to do and so it's not a safe material, okay? This is not safe material for, for knots. Now, let's do the rose itself. This is a provisory movement that I do. Over one, over one, over one and over one wall with all, just to keep the ropes in position. But when the actually rose knot is made, this will be undo by itself when I pull it. So, take a good look. This one is here, right? Comes here and comes here. So I'm going to pass, I'm going to bring back the working hand, it's this one, I'm going to pass it there, exactly there, where under himself. Be careful, don't pierce. Don't pierce the rope, that it is extremely expensive. <laughs> this rope <laughs> is extremely expensive. Okay, you see it? Now there, there is under. So this one is under himself. If I pierce it, it is very bad, I will spoil it. And these ropes are huge price. So keep it like this, why? Because you see, when I pull it, this will undo. This one comes out and this provisory over one, over one, over one, over one will undo and make the rows. Now here you have to be very careful. It is all always in sequence, okay? So here the same, passing it back is this one, this one, so where it is under himself. Here, exactly here. All right. And here you see it it has to pass to bring to come under all near the core all right so it's there exactly there now the more we put it the more difficult will stay because this is very confusing rose knotting is always difficult always even for me with experience is difficult because now we have many already inside, so it is difficult to understand, okay? Keep track, so this is the working hand, this is the back, and it is here, here it is, here, and passing under, under everything. So here we have it, there, I hope you, you are seeing well, here it is. Now the last one, it's the most difficult of all. See, we have here the D working hand. I hope the light shows. So where it is, it comes here, comes here, and it is here. But take a good look. Hope I don't pierce it. Okay, it is good. It is good. Is there? But there is a trick. I have to come not by there, but here, behind this one. Actually, it conceals where it is. Keep it there. I see the hole. You see the hole right there. I hope it is visible. And here it is. All right. Now take take good look as I show you in the beginning. This is the the design one has to have. If one does not have this design, it is wrong. Now when I pull, all these loops will disappear. Take a good look. This is disappearing, this is disappearing, this is disappearing, this is disappearing. Now they will all disappear and they will all curl. And with a little lucky, it will be perfect. Now here you have to check it. If it is in the middle of two, 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 it is perfect. So here we have our rose knot. You see it? It's beautiful. All we have to do now is to pull it more or less as we wish. And it is done. Now rose knotting, it's 
the most beautiful rose, the most beautiful knot in the world. And rose knottings and rose knots are very beautiful. As you can see, this is marvelous. This is marvelous way. As you can see, this rope gives too much slack, too much spaces. So it is good for seeing, but it is not good good for working this knot. Okay, it's extremely good for you to see. Now, in here, I have all right, ten minutes more five. It is okay. I'm going to undo it all. I'm going to call the attention that um, from making different roses, you can actually come from several places. So one of the form is to come under himself. Okay, so now this is undone, but when we bring the rope, I'm going to keep it like this. If I bring this one and I bring under himself, it will do one rose. If I'm if I bring it under the other one, instead of bringing under himself, if I bring it Okay, I'm confused myself. So we bring it, and we bring under himself. It's one rose, but we can bring it under the other one. This is too much open. That's what making the confusion. This is so difficult, it confuses even myself. That's why I'm going to show you the other knot, that it is much easier. And gives the roses the expect, expect also. So the thing is, ah, here it is. Here it is better. If I come under himself, suppose that I want to work this one. I've shown you the rose under himself, but I can, can come under this one in the front or I can come under this one in the back. Instead of coming under that one, I can come under this one. And that is a, a huge difference, okay? Under this one. Or I can come over in under this one, and each way I work, it's a different rose knot. One of these days, I'm going to show you that. But right now, we don't have much time. I'm going to show you another knot to make these beauties. You see this knot? It looks a rose. One sees this and say, okay, it's a rose, it's a beautiful rose. No, this is not a rose. This is a, the other knot that I'm going to show you now. It is different knot and it is not a rose. But it looks like a rose and it's much more easy to do. Let's do it. So for making this, the basis is different. It's not the same basis of Matty Walker. No, you just do this over one, over one. Oh my goodness. Uh -huh. Always open the work. If the work is not open, we will misunderstand ourselves. So, over one, over one, over one, and over one. Okay. So, here we are. Now, take a good look. Under one, under one, under one and under one so this is a completely different knot you know what we are going to do so we are going to pull it we are going to pull to pass again to make the rows so this is with a lot of slack okay but we are going to make the rows over two over two over two over two and over two, so this one passes over this one and that one. And this is going to pull all in the center, and it shows a rose-like effect, but it is not a rose. Don't worry that this is all with a lot of slack. You see the effect? The effect is a rose-like. Rose-like effect. It's very be beautiful and very easy. Now, I'm going to show you this knot in here I'm going to stop the camera and then do all this because we have already show how to do this this is all the same nevertheless I'm going to show you one just to refresh our minds 
so here it is we have already shown several videos with this so I'm going to stop it so here we are the last one so I'll take it out for you to see we have already made these in several videos so please go back to the other videos to see how this is made and now we are going to work this knot this long very long rope don't worry I have to recycle ropes that's right I cannot afford to spend ropes right now and I don't have it and these ropes they are not made anymore at least in my country there are no ropes like this anymore so I'm going to stop the camera and change the the camera so let's undo this I have passed it down okay so here it is this one this one this one and this one you see now we have here the rose the rose like it's not a real rose but it looks like a rose so I'm going to undo it and then I will do it again all oh, hope I have time now here you, you are seeing this structure of this knot so as I told you this was passed under 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 going to stop it okay I've stopped it because it was not visible anything anymore but the beginning yes with the design so what we do here it's very easy for this knot we do over one you keep it here with full force open the work well now bring all under all all over all I'm sorry so this one over this one this one over this one this one over this one and this one over the first one this is very easy to do take a good look so this one is over 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 okay now pull it nine minutes okay I still have time don't lose the grip of these ones and now do it again so now you can see better it's the same work over this one over this one this one over this one this one over this one and now this one over the first one a good look very easy this is very easy this is it has several names and it is described also in books now with this second we can pull it because now it is already the work is strong now turn it and with this part that was the first knot the first knot pull it again you see how much slack there is take a good look and we pull it so it is all perfect I'm not going to pull anymore because I don't have time time is very important in video right so we have done the first and now it's what I've shown you we have passed over now we're going to pass under with all under one under one under one and under one and here we have the basis this is the basis this is the equivalent to the Matthew Walker in the rose knot but it is not a Matthew Walker it's something much more easy to do okay and fast now take the good look pass it over two over this one and this one so over two this one over two is this is all always in sequence this is very easy you know the last one over two over this one and this one that are loops over this one and this one and here it is now you pull it and what we have it's a rosish like work seven minutes okay good so this is a rose like it's not a real rose but it is almost a rose okay and it is easy because anyone can do this work but to do a rose it's hard especially for for beginning beginners to learn a rose it can take days weeks months or even years 
I took years to learn how to do rose knotting, that's right. And even now I'm learning, so you see how much complex this is. But this is so beautiful, right? So I was looking for the ring, I don't have it, I'm going to pull it a little more. Because then in the ring we are going to, to make force with it. Now in here we can use several tricks, we can pass these ones up or we can pass these ones down. Now in the other one I pass it up. Let's see what happens if I pass it down. Uh -huh, perhaps it's better because they come together from the same place. So notice that I'm doing already different from what I've shown you. The first, you, you remember the ring in the wood? Why? Because the ring in the wood, I've made the opposite. I took this one and passed it up to meet this one. Okay, but now I'm doing the opposite. I'm passing the one that is up to meet the one that is down. Each one will give, of course, different designs, a small change. Sometimes can be small, sometimes can, can be big. Aha, you can see it is already a different, a different design. Yes, it is different. So let's work the ring, I don't know where it is. Okay, I found it. And here we have the ring. Now for the ring, it is important to begin with the ones that are under. Okay, so I'm going to use this one. Five minutes, okay, we have some time. Not to do it all, but to do at least... Oh my goodness, so much, right? I'm going to use another one, because this is too much. We don't have time for this. So I'm going to use the one from the lower part. Well, it is big, but it is not so big. So, passing over the ring, bring it in the lower part up, hold it, pass it down, and pass it inside the loop and bring it. Now in here, I have to be careful with this. Ah, I, I, I lost, I, I lose the, the grip. You, you saw it, didn't you? I lose it and I shouldn't have done that. Because that is extremely bad. The work with st will stay with the slack. So don't do that, please. I'm going to close the camera and do the other one. The other one is the opposite from this one. And the, oppos the opposite from this one is this one. You see it? This is opposite to this one. That's what we have to work. I'm going to close it and work it. Okay, so I have made already this one. It's the same thing. The only thing we have to take care is that we have to use these ones now because it's the other ones from the lower part. So this makes a cross. Alright? It's important. Now I'm going to work this one. Again, the same thing, pass it over from the under part, the under part is this side, hold it here, three minutes, okay, I'm going to close it. Okay, so I have made the other two, so the crossing is complete, you see it? So this one with this one and this one with this one. Now it's time for work these ones that come here in the middle of this one. I'm going to close it because I have two minutes. It's the same thing always. This is all, ah, this is short. So this comes here. I'm, I'm holding it in the back, okay? I'll hold it in the front. I pass it here. Already. I take this slack. And I pull it. 
Okay, these ones are, are, are faster. So I'm going to do the other one in the opposite from this one to this one. Two minutes, all right. And that's it. So this is very easy to do. It's much more uh, for for people with less experience. But please don't give up of the rose knotting. All right, and finally the last one. Okay, up in here. Hold it down now inside this loop. All right. Now in here, bring the slack of the loop and close it, and it is done. So I have one minute. This has to be all all pulled like this. You pull it, you pull it all, and then you close this, and you put it in position in perfect this with this this with this now as you can see this design is different from the design that was shown in the first because of a difference little difference i've passed all down but this is much more perfect if you take a good look in the beginning the first one was not so perfect as this but perhaps it was beautiful so there are many ways to do this okay I'm going to show you slowly by slowly, video by video. In the next video I will show you the real difference of this one. But this is a beautiful rose knot. Like, it's not a rose, but it is almost like a rose. And the back is perfect, as always. And I hope you have enjoyed this, because this is very beautiful. We can make belts. If I make a, here a belt, then I can turn it to the other side and make a, a knot. I will show you in the next videos. Thank you so much.